and take one. Wait, what did I call this thing? Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. It's been a long, long time because I got burnt out. Today, we're gonna be doing the ultimate White Claw taste test tournament where I decide which White Claw is the best. Oh boy. Wait, this could be literally anything. Maybe it's lime? These have to be lemon and lime. Oh no. Where is the raspberry? Oh, this one smells awful. <laughs> so bad, actually that's so bad. I have my assistant a boyfriend over there and he is going to be setting them up so that I will not know which ones I'm tasting and I'm going to be blindfolded for this. We have all of the two variety packs here and then I was able to find these new 70 calorie pineapple and clementine. I had to go to a very sketchy place to find them. He's going to line them all up and I guess I'm just going to taste two versus each other and figure out which ones I like the best and narrow it down to five. And then I guess with the five, I'll do two versus two and then taste the one on its own. And then we'll do the three. This is not a math equation. <laughs> oh, and one other thing. That's right. I found four loco hard seltzer and we're gonna get started by trying that. I, <laughs> this is 12% and these are 5%. Oh, was these the same? These are only 3%. That's boring. Oh God, that's really bad. Try it. Is it aggressively bad? Oh, yeah. It's like horse piss. Oh, what? yeah. It smells like a porta potty, but tastes like NyQuil and Red Bull had a baby. In natty. Okay, no more of that. Does it look done though? I mean, just pair them off however you think best. I don't drink White Claw that often, so I want to see if I can label them as well as pit them against each other. You know. That one should be easy. I mean, I think these are pretty distinct flavors. So that it goes like this. Uh -huh. Okay! <laughs> okay, I'm try this one first. Show the camera. Yeah, you didn't show the label. <laughs> <laughs> it's cute. There you go. The this is like up. QVC. Today on QVC, we're um, getting hammered. Bing, bang, boom. Oh no. Is this mango? That's pretty good. Oh boy. Wait, this could be literally anything. Is it mango? <laughs> is it mango? They all taste, everyone says the mango is the best, but I think that they all taste the same. Is White Claw still relevant? The thing is, there's like, there's mango, tangerine, clementine, and lemon. And those are all very similar fruits. Yeah. I know. Do you think this is I think this is tangerine, if I'm guessing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> First guess is mango, tangerine. Honestly, this one is better. It's better because it doesn't taste like much, so it's kind of like subtler. Like this is the second pairing. Uh -huh. Okay. This, oh no, this might be mango. <laughs> Wait, did you put all the citrus ones right at the front? I'm not telling you anything. This one's mango. That means the other one's not mango. Maybe this one's clementine and tangerine. That would make sense that you put those two together. So I think this one's mango. Okay. This one seems new to me. This one's definitely pineapple and it tastes pretty good actually. The only reason it's bad is that it, like the same pineapple flavoring is definitely in the pineapple for loco. But if I had never had the pineapple for loco, this would be good. Watch it not even be pineapple. <laughs> okay, round <clears throat> three. Oh, this one smells awful. Maybe that's just my hand. I, oh no. I'm feeling like this could be watermelon, but then again, I feel like the watermelon will be stronger. Oh no, they're all kind of starting to taste exactly the same. I think this one's lemon. <laughs> Based on you immediately laughing, I think that's wrong. Maybe it's lime? It's definitely, did you put lemon and lime together? That would make sense. What else is there? These have to be lemon and lime. This is lime. And I guess that's lemon. <laughs> I have no idea. So, so far I like these three better. Maybe I should change them for the camera. Okay. If you can read them, I like these three the best so far. Oh no, this one smells exactly like a lime. Oh no, Travis. This one's lime. 
Smells like lemon. Oh no. What the f are the last two? This is definitely lemon. And the other one's definitely lime. And I've always said that I like the lime one the best, but the lemon is better if, if I'm holding lemon. Okay, this is better than this for sure. And that one tastes like lime. Okay, back to these. What are they? What are you? <laughs> what do they do in wine tasting? Got air rate. Swish, swish. Tangerine. Clementine? Let's use big brain here. You would have done tangerine and mango, clementine and pineapple. Isn't there grapefruit? Wait, is there a grapefruit one? Yes. Oh my God. So there's five, there's six citrus ones. Mm -hmm. These are all the same. <laughs> Ooh, this one's kind of twangy. I like this one. Maybe this one's grapefruit. Cheers. I've no idea what this one is. These are def, these have to be black cherry and watermelon because I have not tasted either of those yet. Or my taste buds are whack right now. Raspberry, oh no. Where is the raspberry? I feel like it's gotta be one of these. I don't know where it is, but I'm thinking this is the raspberry. Okay, now two more. This is, has to be black cherry. Yep, there it is. I don't even need to try that one again. I don't like that one. Oh no, this doesn't smell like watermelon. <laughs> This has to be watermelon. Final answer, that's watermelon. What if that's the black cherry? Why is this so hard? I hate both of these, so I'm gonna nix them both, and I'm gonna guess one is cherry and one is watermelon, but at this point, I literally don't know. Okay, let's go back to the beginning. I probably had like one white call at this point. At this point, I've had one white call vibes. I gotta stop talking British accent. You know that, that TikTok when your drink starts tasting like you wanna have a British accent for the rest of the night? Why do I feel, I feel like, like this? this? I'm there, and it's noon. Wait, which one did I put in front of the other one? Yeah, this one's better. <laughs> well, which one do you think that is? Some kind of orange citrus. <laughs> I'm gonna guess this is <laughs> tangerine. It's getting hard on my body. I can tell this one's pineapple and it's good. With no clue, maybe grapefruit. I'm gonna guess these are grapefruit and raspberry. I have no clue. I don't even remember what's left. What's left? <laughs> I can't tell you. Lemon and lime, these are lemon and lime. Okay, so these are my top four. So yeah. those are gone and these are my top four. You can drink one if you want. I'll allow it. How many did we buy today? Um, 32. 12. 12, 12, and then the other one is just 12 in all. There were only six in those. So okay, so we have 30. We're doing a giveaway, guys. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> My acid reflux. I just have it. Where are they? Maybe when I don't like one, I'll just push it away. Did you change them up? Yes. Are you lying? No. Did your dad just come out here? No. Who was that? I'm not kidding, they all taste identical now. Yeah. This is pineapple, and it's bad. So it's, it's going back here for now. I'm thinking this, I'm thinking this is, it's a tangerine. It's better than this one. And smell, it smells like, oh God. It smells like beta basement. Something, there's something really disorienting about it being so sunny and having the blindfold on and being a little tipsy in the middle of the day. This one is bad also. I think this is mango. <laughs> I think they're all mango. Oh my God, I might throw up. Definitive, these two mixed. Final two, I'm guessing the one that was over here was tangerine and the one that was over here was grapefruit. This one is good. This one's the winner. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a winner. Okay, put the, put, take this away. Down, it's down there. I'm gonna guess this is tangerine, and it's my favorite. Dun, da, da, da. <gasps> Clementine? Clementine? Oh my god, it's so bright out here now. Um, it tastes more like a seltzer plus a little bit of something. Mm. Wait, what was the other one? Grapefruit? Grapefruit? Well, at least I knew that. Which personally I thought was disgusting. 
Yeah. Wait, let me try the mango. People f***ing love the mango. Because they sell just mango. Yeah. Like in, like, 16 packs. This might be controversial, but brave. Taste also has to do with being able to see it. Like, knowing it's mango, when I smell it, I, it's mango. You know what I mean? And when I taste it, it's mango. Okay, well, I guess what we've learned here is when it comes to seltzers, the less amount of percentage of alcohol, the better it tastes. Because... This one's really good. I highly recommend it. If you go to their website and type in a store, look for this one, and then type in stores that sell this one, half of them don't have it. But some of them, like Food Market in sketchy Jacksonville, Florida, does sell them. So if you can find it, I would say this is the best one. It's less percentage, so if you're trying to get drunk, obviously this one doesn't work, but it tastes the best. If you didn't know, White Claw had all these new flavors come out. And by all these, I mean two. And they're 70 calories, so health queen status. Make sure you <laughs> subscribe because you guys could help change my life. All it takes is one subscribe from millions of people. <laughs> <laughs> Tune in next week where I'll be trying every Four loco seltzer. <laughs> no, you will not. Bye, guys. <laughs> so bad. Actually, that's so bad. I don't know the difference between a tangerine and a grapefruit as far as taste goes or an orange what's another one pomelo what's a pomelo that's a pomegranate pomelo is a, a pomegranate and an orange mixed right what's the pom part i don't know but those are two different plant species they would not have a okay but so are apples and pears and they have pear apples purples pear they're called pear apples know your stuff before you come for me